Crap! Alright, we're not gonna actually spend too much time fighting these guys. I just wanted to see if my entire team would suddenly pep up in one go. Like Sylvando just running in. Oh right, I forgot. Everybody will just patiently wait for me. I don't want to flee from battle. I want to bang from the back. I know what I'm saying. <laughs> the game's not really designed for this. <laughs> He's <laughs> like, wait, where'd that guy go? Oh, over here. If you want some good e leveling, you can make it nighttime and ride back to the runes. Huh. Tons of experience. Wait, the runes here or the runes in, um... The runes with, like, the cryptic crypt, or Mount Huji or something. The, uh... Oops. Okay, the runes here. Big circle on the map. We'll do that after. I might do that between episodes. Like, like I said earlier, this is probably going to be one of those series that I actually overgrind uh, pretty hard, so I'm, like, stupidly overleveled and we can just kind of breeze through the game. I like it. I like the idea of the challenge of it, but it's huh, also one of those where easy. the less uh, the less trouble I have on camera, the faster everything's gonna go. We should probably check our skill points. I bet we have quite a lot on Veronica and uh, her sister. Yep. All right. Uh, let's check. Cause yeah, we got our increased magical might, resistance to fire and earth, ice and wind. Right, we want to save up for that. And that is 10. Well, that was quick. Okay, magical mending. This game has a sphere a sphere grid. Barely. Barely has a sphere grid. Sphere grid. Probably go down that direction next. Like if uh, this game has about as much of a sphere grid as, eh, no, I don't know. It's like super sphere grid light. That's really all I can describe it as. Which is, it's like, it's like enough character customization to kind of make you feel like you're doing something, but not enough to actually feel satisfying. I'm really shocked more JRPGs have not gone the route of, uh, you know, the sphere grid system from Final Fantasy. It's like saying Diablo 2 has a sphere grid. Except for Diablo 2 had, like, an interesting talent system. It was weird, but it worked well. Because Dia Diablo 2 actually really, like, you really could do quite a lot with it. At least from what I remember, especially once they added the synergy system. Because I don't remember they were originally having, like, synergies and stuff. Does anybody know of actually any good, uh, JRPGs? Uh, any good JRPGs with, uh, like, deep character customizations? Because I can't think of any immediately. Did I do all right? Not that I've played recently. Like, there's kind of stuff like Final Fantasy Tactics, which I really loved. The, uh, the equipment-based skill acquisi acquisition system was really neat. But there haven't been a whole lot of, like, other games as deep as that. Supposedly you could get kind of deep with, uh, Nino Kuni 2, but it didn't matter that much? Victory! Yeah, someday I'd like to actually play through Di Diablo 2 with the whole group as a, like, you know, a fun series. I I don't know how it would go. I'd love to do Diablo 2 as a, uh, as two different series. One, like, as a play through Diablo 1, 2, and 3 is just kind of a thing. Uh, but that would be kind of hard to work with. I hope, I hope we get a Diablo remaster at some point. That would be cool. 
Uh, but the other thing I'd like to do is a a hardcore uh, series on Diablo 2, where everybody just effectively piles into one session and starts playing through, and as people die, they move off into the, the next session until you only have, like, the, the finalists actually making it to the end of the game. Because that would be cool. Because, I don't know, the idea of, like, a uh, hardcore series would be fun. Diablo 3 is coming for the Switch. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I'd play it on the... I don't think I'd play it on the Switch, though. If I were to play Diablo anywhere, I'd probably play it on... If we were doing couch co-op, it would probably be on the PS4. Because we have enough controllers for that. Actually, no, I don't know. Because I do have... Oh, right, I probably shouldn't be using fire damage against the water monster. Probably save my my SP here. Uh, MP that words. Because we do have a boss fight coming up. We're not terribly wounded. The Slayer of the Sands was last seen here. Ah. <laughs> Cowardly creature is nowhere to be found. It must have fled in fear. Let us return to the castle and inform my father of our success. The Slayer of the Sands is among us! <laughs> <laughs> that crab is a multi-tool. Open Adam Principal. Show that filthy thing what real knights are made of. <laughs> oh dear. Looks like poor old Ferris has been struck down with stage fright. You soldiers, be dears and look after him, will you? Come on, gang. This little drama needs a hero or two. <laughs> All right, uh, let's see. So apparently this guy is tough. Well, that's not a good time sign. Okay, view party stat status, no. Tactics. I'm gonna have her follow orders for the time being. Okay, back abilities. Now he's probably not a dragon. We'll try fire. That's damage. Yeah, that was worth it. Yeah, getting dual wielding on Eric was a was a very good idea. Okay, so what does she have? She's got a shit ton. So we tried to do fizzle. Why? It's bedazzle. Okay, we want to do sap. Think you're tough, dude. He's not a magic casting enemy. Why would you? <sighs> Whoa, that was worth it. Yeah, why would you ever cast the fizzle? Holy crap! It even made Serena do damage. Uh oh. But yeah, sap does a ton of damage. Okay. And unfortunately, this guy blocks really well, but yeah, sapping him helps. No. Hey. Wait. Wait. Veronica flees? Wait, that's a thing? Ow! Oh, okay. 
Bosses in this game can crit. That's a bad. That's real bad. Keep sapping its defense. Let's see if it, it stacks. Nope. Okay. Had to test. Oh, we are dangerous when we do this. And... He is dangerous when he does that. Ouch. Okay, spells, bang, snooze. Can I... I bet I can't snooze him. I'm not even gonna bother. Let's heal her for the time being. Before things Don't become worry. a problem. I'm here to help. Okay, spells. Oh, I see. It's got defense down for two more turns. Single enemy with razor sharp icicles. He's actually looking pretty injured, so that's a good sign. Okay, he's not too bad. Yeah, casting sap on him was was exactly what we needed. Pax is. Back. I gotta try to decelerate. That might have been a good idea. Cause yeah, this game does does follow a uh, a it's purely speed based how often you attack, which I actually really did. Uh, uh -oh. Never mind. Yeah, confusion could go real bad for me. Uh, let's heal self. Don't worry, I'm here to help. I do kind of wish we could see the uh, the upcoming turn order. Okay, so he's he's lost his defense down. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, so use sap in the future, cause hot damn, that has cranked up the damage we do by so much. And we're pepped up, but we don't actually have anything special that we can do on our own. We'll soon have that patched up. Okay, the two next to the defense is the level. You can have two levels up or down on any one ability. Good to know. Ow! Well, that's okay. Be a higher level than average, easy, probably. Easy. And sap. Sap is the boss killer. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold on to that strategy. <sighs> that will teach you to be so grumpy. Now, hold nice and still while I tie you up. <laughs> the battle is won! The Slayer of the Sands is bested! All in a day's work for the Prince of Galopolis! <laughs> you saw me, men, did you not? You saw the People's Prince defeat the fiend that terrorized them so. Uh, yes, your highness. Of course, your highness. <sighs> you have my thanks, Fred. My heroic feat would not have been possible without your... ...valuable... ...contribution. <laughs> I still have not forgotten what I promised. I will speak with my father about the rainbow upon my return. You may rest assured of that. Really, Principal? That's how you're gonna play it? And what do you think they'll be expecting of you next, huh? You speak as though I have a choice! Are you suggesting that I disappoint my father and the citizens of Galopolis? <sighs> I'm not suggesting anything, darling. You do what you need to do. <laughs> to Galopolis, men! We return as heroes! Yeah! Uh, 
Ah, oh, well, this feels all kinds of wrong. You're right, Silvando. Nothing's going to change if he keeps on pretending. Oh, I think the poor boy knows that well enough. All he needs is a little push. Anyway, I'd better be getting along. I'm sure we'll bump into each other again soon. Ciao for now, my loves! Wait. Oh, no. Nope. Wait. Zoom. Back to Galpolopolis. Ah. Party. I'm tired. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that cool figure. My fellow Gallopolitans, Faris, your prince, my son, our hero, has vanquished the Slayer of the Sands. <laughs> yeah, that's it! <laughs> yeah! The future of our kingdom is surely safe in the hands of one so gallant and chivalrous as he. Now come, heroic conqueror, address your people. Beloved Gallopolitans, yes, I captured the beast, but I did not act alone. <laughs> For it was your love, your adoration, that gave me the strength I so needed! Yes! <laughs> Hi. And it is that same love that will allow me to continue serving you until my dying day. We have no need to be afraid. Prince Faris will protect us. Yes, yes! We have nothing to fear with the prince on our side! Faris! 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 Oh, they'll keep going. Well, my boy! Your people are weak. Let them see firsthand the fearless desert knight you have become. <sighs> Father, Father, I cannot. <gasps> Repeat after me now. A knight's word? Uh, a knight's word is his bond. His kingdom, his master. Huh? 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 <gasps> well, don't stop. He... He serves the weak untiringly. Challenges the strong unflinchingly. And... And never retreats in the face of adversity. That's more like it. Now, my little Principu, do you want to be remembered as a miserable coward or a hero who died fighting to the end? I. I wish to be remembered as a knight of Galopolis! <laughs> Oh. 
darling, you were wonderful. Amazing what you can do when you put your mind to it, huh? Huh? Wait, did you? I won't always be here to remind you what it means to be a knight, though. Better not go forgetting again, huh? Mm hmm. Wait, a friend, where did you become so well versed in the ways of chivalry? Are you a knight? Who, me? Don't be ridiculous, darling. I'm just a silly old jester. Oh, that's weird. They actually have, like, palm lines in there. I think that's actually one of the first JRPGs I've seen that. One of the only ones with cartoon... That's real weird. I mean, it actually doesn't look terrible, but it, I'm just not used to that. Yes, father. It... It was he who rode my horse in the Sun National. And he who captured the Slayer of the Sands. Forgive me. Ferris, oh. look at me. The burden that was placed upon you, it was more than any boy could be expected to bear. It is I who must apologize, not you. But rest assured that I have learned my lesson. I will not make the same mistake again. And it seems you have learned something too, despite your protestations. The bravery you showed was worthy of a true knight. Sir Hendrik will be happy to take one such as yourself under his wing, I am sure. <sighs> Your dream will come true at last. I am so pleased for you. <laughs> Hendrik? Wasn't that the name of the guy who was chasing us? Ah, but I am forgetting our guests. Father, these travelers came to Galopolis in search of the rainbow. It is a royal treasure, of course. But surely you agree that they have done more than enough to deserve it. Certainly, certainly. But my boy, I sold the rainbow to a traveling merchant. What? What would compel you to sell one of our most precious treasures? Are you blind, boy? Did you not notice the grandeur with which we celebrated this year's Sand National? We made a sacrifice for your sake. F Father, I... I... Uh, <sighs> Forgive me. All I can tell you is that the merchant to whom I sold the rainbow headed west towards Gondolia. This letter will grant you passage through the checkpoint that leads there. Perhaps someone can tell you what became of the branch. It's a very small letter, watched in the palm of my hand. You can't see it. We've received the Sultan's letter. Oh, oh, ow! A thousand pardons! I did not know that the rainbow was no longer in the kingdom. Truly, I did not. It is scant consolation, I am sure, but please, take this. Its value cannot possibly compare, but it has been prized by generations of Gallopolitan knights. It allows one to provoke distant foes into combat, and is an excellent way to gain battle experience. Or so I am told. <laughs> We've received the Crackshot Crossbow. You have done our kingdom a great service. Should you ever need our assistance, you need only say the word. And as for me, I will be sorry to see you leave. But I am sure there will be other gallop... <coughs> Kindly travelers along soon enough. <laughs> yes? Yeah? <laughs> well, we're done. Bye.
we probably just have one more thing where Sylvando decides to join us. And then we go after the merchant, who's probably another party member. To be ter uh, totally honest. What the prince and the team. Everyone would die. It would be bad. Uh, why do we- what? What is that? Whenever we come out of a door, we run left or right, never forward. And I have no idea why. At last! I was beginning to think you had snuck out through the stage door. Huh? Ow. Hey! You again. What do you want this time? hey -ya! ta -da! <gasps> Oh, don't be coy, darling. I want to come with you, of course. You should never have told me about your heroic quest if you didn't want me to tag along. What are you talking about? You can't just decide to come with us. This isn't a game. Yes, it is. <sighs> Believe me, honey, I know it isn't. I've seen my fair share of fun and games on my travels. What kind of jester would I be if I hadn't? But I've seen tragedy, too. People attacked by monsters, all kinds of awful things. You know, my dream has always been to build a wonderful theater. Somewhere I can put on performances that will make millions smile. But how can I do that if this dark one of yours is going to be out there making people's lives awful? What I'm trying to say, darlings, is that we all want the same thing. So you see, I have to come with you. Oh, don't all squeal at once now. Silvando so forces his way into the party. No one is terribly disappointed by this. This guy really doesn't take no for an answer, huh? Guess I'm part of the gang now. Yay! So, tell me, what's our next move? Well, to get to Yggdrasil, we're going to need the Rainbow. And it seems that a traveling merchant has taken it to Gondolia. Gondolia. But honey, that's a port town. He's probably hopped on a boat and set sail by now. That's true. Well, mm, then we'll have to buy tickets for the ferry, and... The ferry? Please, darling. We don't have time to be riding the ferry with the little people. Well, what's your bright idea, then? I was thinking a sheep of our own might be more chic, no? And luckily for you, I happen to have picked up a lovely little number in the end of season sales. What? You've got your own boat? That's amazing! You're going up in my estimation by the minute. You'd really be willing to let us use your ship, Mr. Sylvander? But of course, sweetie. That's what friends are for. And guess where the old girl is dog, hmm? No? Why, Gondolia, of course! Lucky! So what are we waiting for? The ocean beckons, shipmate! Westward ho! Alright. So, Fives a crowd. With Savando on, on board, your merry band is now up to full five members. Sadly, only four... Only four of you can take part in battle at one time. You can pick which ones by selecting the lineup from the menu. Or on the fly during battle. Okay, that's good. So, first and foremost, character builder. Silvando has swords, swords, knives, whips, litheness, and showmanship. Why is his skill tree so much larger? Well, I guess it's not actually that much long larger. It's none of his skill tree is randomly hidden. Okay. So he also has dual wielding, but it is a distance and a half away. Can confuse all enemies, charm. And he can dual wield whips. Quick 
people to sleep. He's got a lot of just stat bonuses. I don't even know what Charm does, unfortunately. What's the damage with knives? Uh, whips are two-handed. Ah, oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! He seems kind of okay. Sobering slap is helpful. Charm increases the likelihood of a rare monster showing up. Oh, okay, good to know. Well, I'll probably keep Silvando out of the party for the time being. Uh, magic. No. Let me check in combat magic. Oh, that's neat. Okay, well, let's see if I can put him in the dancer's outfit, because that's the other thing I wanted to check before we go anywhere. I'm going to be disappointed. Yeah, I am thoroughly disappointed. Dang. The worst comes to worst, you can freely tag people in and out of battle. Which I love. Yeah, that's that's a really nice system. I, I love it when games let you do that. I don't know how much I'm going to do, and I don't think I'm going to touch my current lineup, because... We've got a we've got a mage debuffer, we've got burst damage AoE, and we've got the main character who's an all-rounder who I don't think could be removed from the party. I could be wrong. But I don't think he can I don't think we can be removed from the party, unfortunately. And honestly, like, Tungs is a perfectly fine character. It's just the dual wielding man. It's too good. Okay. Unfortunately, this is going to be where I pop off for now.